Hey guys, today I'm going to be going to Mancini's, Mancino's, sorry. Um, this is a pizza and grinders. It's an Italian restaurant. They, they have a bunch of locations around. I saw Indiana, Kentucky, um, Illinois, maybe there's a few other ones anyway. Um, so I ordered online and I'm going to run in here. It's in like a shopping center uh, with a Kroger and stuff. So anyway, I'm going to run in here and pick up my order and then I'll be back. Okay. Here is the, um, oven baked, uh, fries, which look really good. And then this is the uh, grinder that I bought. That I bought. It's basically just a hot sub. And um, I'll go through what it has on it here in just a second once I move the camera around. But um, and the total and all that stuff. But this is what it looks like. It looks really, really good. The bread's good and toasted even on the bottom. So and then I got a drink, just a regular bottle of uh, Coke, Diet Coke. So anyway, let me get the camera turned around and I'll just tell you what I bought and then uh, then we'll try it out. Okay, so I got the um, just the half grinder. I can't even imagine what a full size grinder is. That'd be huge. Um, so anyway, I got um, the Valentini's, V-A-L-E-N-T-I, apostrophe S, um, Italian Combo. Um, it includes, this is the house specialty for this particular location. Um, they don't offer it everywhere. They may offer it other places, but they, I know it's one, they say it's a house special here. Um, it is ham, sausage, salami, mushrooms, onions, green peppers, lettuce, um, cheese, lettuce, tomato, and mayo the oven baked fries and then the uh, the coke like i said the the half grinder was 7.49 the fries i think are a little expensive they were 2.99 maybe that's not bad and then the drink of course was a dollar 89 which is always expensive so my total with tax and everything was 13.11 here's the drink i got just a bottle of drink um so i'm excited to try these fries they did give me this little thing of uh, of ketchup so that's nice These are like cooked in a pizza oven. They have like a little scorch on them. Hmm. I like those. They were more remind you of a um, like a steak fry or a um, a really thick uh, French fry cut fry. So they're good. I love a good thick uh, steak fry. So I don't have any problems with those at all. Okay, now I'm gonna try the sandwich. It did not come cut in half. I cut it in half. Um, I grabbed a knife while I was in there and uh, and cut it in half myself because it's just easier to deal with. But you can see, see what the you can see the ham and all that good stuff, the salami and the tomato and the lettuce. So here we go. I'm trying to think of the best approach to this. Hmm. Well, you can really taste that salami. Take a bite from the other side. Hmm. I have to say, that is a really good sandwich. I love the toasted bread, the bread being toasted and the whole sandwich being heated up is excellent. I love a good hot uh, sandwich. The salami has a little spice to it, but it's not so spicy to where you can't eat it. It's not like a, a really hot spice. It's just a nice, um, a nice spiced salami. So it's not, um, if you don't like spicy food, you'd be fine with this. It's just, it's just regular spicy salami. I mean, it's just regular salami. Um, I've had some salami that didn't have much flavor at all. This one does have some good flavors to it. And the ham tastes really, really good. It's got a little bit of a smoky kind of flavor to it. Um, the mushrooms, I, don't, I, I get a little bit of the mushroom taste, uh, but not a lot. You can taste the onions and, and the tomato and stuff. I think this is excellent. The, um, the quality of the, the meats and the bread and everything is just really good. And you get a decent amount of bread on there. I mean, a decent amount of uh, fillings to bread ratio is really good. The bread's not super thick. It's a thinner bread and you get a decent amount of meat and um, toppings. And you could have added more toppings. They cost about 75 cents each though. So if you wanted to add like hot banana peppers, you could click the button to add uh, hot banana peppers, jalapenos or whatever. It was 75 cents, like I said, to, to add one. But if you were in the mood for something spicier or hotter, then you could get the added to it as well. So um, ordering online was really, really nice. This is a really good meal. I would eat here any day of the week. Um, I would give this a five. It's really, really good. Uh, I'm sure every one of these are a little different. They're, um, you know, 
depending on what area they're in or where they're located, but I'd say base sandwiches are basically the same. So I would encourage you, if you have one of these in your area, um, Tammy, I'll put a link down below in the, in the video to where you can find the location nearest to you. And if you have one, if you've never tried one, you should try one out. They have some really good grinders. Um, they have pizza too. Pizza, you can order pizza, pasta, salads. They've got all kinds of different stuff. So hope you enjoy this video. Thanks for watching. Okay, I wanted to give you a quick follow-up. There's there's a couple things that I've, that I've noticed as I've eaten more of it. One, the fries, you want if you get fries, eat those first because they get cold and they get kind of soggy. So eat those first. They were really good and crisp when I first got them, but then I ate like half the sandwich and then went back to them and they got a little bit soggy. They're just not bad, but they're uh they're definitely not as they're definitely more soggy than they were when they first started. So anyway, eat your fries first. That's all I gotta say. Um if I were to order again, I may get, they have um, like a garlic bread. It was more expensive. It was like $5. So I didn't get that. And they also have just regular chips, like bag of chips. So I think I'd probably go for a bag of chips or a, I wonder if they do a half order of garlic bread. Anyway, um, the fries are good as long as you can eat them pretty quickly. If you have to let them sit in a bag, if you're driving, um, you know, from your pickup to work or wherever, um, I don't know if I'd get fries because they do get soggy quick because they're so big two i love the sandwich the sandwich is still excellent the only complaint i have with it is the green peppers are raw green peppers like literally they've just been chopped up and thrown on there um same with the onions i wish they had been like heated up a little bit i wish they put those on there and baked it with the sandwich because i really would have liked those to be a little softer but uh, but that's my only complaint if that's the only thing i got to complain about that's not much to complain about so anyway i just wanted to follow up still love the sandwich and stuff i still give it a five any day definitely try one out so anyway see you later